आदू चल बाकू जाते बाकू वो कहा है अरे बाकू है ना अजरबैजान में एक सिटी है अजरबैजान इज नेक्स्ट टू टर्की काफी अच्छा सिटी है मैंने काफी सुना है चल जाते हैं वहाँ पे But I have not heard about it. Is it a tourist place? It is a tourist place. It's a very good place. Chal wahan pe, chal chalte. Um. Okay. All right. Let's go. We are off to Baku, and look at this munchkin. Look at this munchkin. Yeah, Tiff. Yeah, out, out. I know you don't want us to go. He just figures out that we are about to go somewhere, and then he gets uh, very, very cranky. Like he just sit around you and not let you go anywhere. So I just wish I could take him with us. So before we leave for Baku, we wanted to take a quick run to the salon. I wanted some blow drying to be done, and May needed a quick haircut. So we're done taking care of the hair, and it's time for the face now. So I am somebody who doesn't usually wear too much makeup or doesn't like to put too much makeup on my face. I prefer taking care of my skin, which is why I have this very quick routine that I follow. Glass skin is something that is so in right now, and I have a few products that have helped me achieve that look. So the first product that I have is Mama Earth's Rice Face Scrub. This product is enriched with niacinamide and rice water. This face scrub has such an amazing texture; it literally looks like soft crust. Ice. So the face scrub has rice beads, which helps to exfoliate my skin gently. I anyway have a little sensitive skin, and this does not create any kind of rashes, which is something that I really love. After washing the scrub off, my skin really feels plump and hydrated. And as you guys can see, it's glowing as well, and it's not dried out. It's still pre-hydrated. So this range has two more products, which is the rice day cream. and the rice oil face moisturizer so i really like this moisturizer because it's quick absorbing it has a very light texture and keeps your skin hydrated overall which is why i'm taking it to baku as well so why i like shopping from mama earth is that because it's an indian brand it is free from harmful chemicals and is all natural so i recently got to know about mama earth's plant goodness initiative and i think that's a very very cool initiative here the link a tree to your purchase and then they send you the geo location the species all of that about that particular tree so you can go and see for yourself other than that mama earth is also made safe certified in case you want to purchase these products you can use my code arya2022 and get a 20% discount on mamaearth.in and the official app both of which i'll link down below you can also purchase these products on amazon nike and purple.com so yes that's how my skin is all prepped and ready for baku so happy shopping to you and happy travel to us okay bye We reached Mumbai International Airport and checked in to fly with Air Arabia. Now from Mumbai to Baku there are no direct flights so we had a layover of 6 hours in Sharjah. All of the 6 hours we spent in the lounge just sleeping and eating and then we flew to reach Baku. In Baku we went straight to our hotel to check in. After some good rest in the hotel we left for the Highland Park in evening it's in the center of Baku city where you will find memorials for all the people who have sacrificed their life for the freedom of Azerbaijan also there's a fire burning all the time in respect to their sacrifice We found a good spot and just chill there chit chatting and enjoying the various light displays on the flame towers of Baku. Also the panoramic view of the Baku city at night from Highland Park is a great view. So we all set for day two. पहले breakfast करेंगे hotel में and उसके बाद we have planned lot of activities today in Baku. We'll go to the shooting range, also to the local Nizami Street and to the Baku's Eye. 
और अगर ये सब कैप्चर करना है तो ऐसे कैमरा नहीं छोड़ के जा सकते रूम में हाई मे सब गाइस वी एड बाकू शूटिंग रेंज यू वी हैव कम फॉर सम शूटिंग काफी सुना है इसके बारे में सो लेट्स ट्राई आउट हाउ इट इज आर यू एक्साइटेड आउट यस आई एम सो फॉर द वेदर इट्स एक्सट्रीमली सनी ओवर हियर बट एट द सेम टाइम द ब्रीज इज सो कोल्ड दैट इट डजंट मेक यू फील दैट हॉट सो आई थिंक इट्स अ वेरी नाइस टेंपरेचर ऑफ इट या आई लव दिस टेंपरेचर इट्स ओनली दैट द सन लिटिल बिट इज बर्निंग ऑन द स्किन बट इट्स ओके Oh don't shoot me don't shoot me don't shoot me Wow it's fun the shooting experience in Baku we got to try our hands on the sniper and Adi just loved it Now we leave for our next spot the Heather Alive Center So we are at the Heather Alive Center. Oh yeah. That's the one. And there's a sign which says I love Baku. Um and it's a tourist spot for everybody to come click pictures over here. There's always a fascination about this I love sign. Pata nahi kya but iske sath photo lete hain aur humne bhi wohi kiya. Humne bhi uske sath photo liya. इतने अच्छे ग्रीन लॉन्स में आदू वॉन्टेड टू टेक अ रनिंग शॉट और वो ही आई लव बाकू साइन के ऊपर हमने कैमरा रखा और ये रनिंग शॉट लिया जितना तेज़ हम भाग के जा रहे हैं उतना ही तेज़ एटलीस्ट मैं तो भाग के आया बिकॉज आई वाज वेरी स्केयर कि कोई कैमरा उठा के लेना जाए बट इट वाज वेरी मच फन इसके बाद वी लीव फॉर नेक्स्ट स्पॉट दैट इज द बाकू साइन Bakuza is a Ferris wheel ride a 20 minute ride where you get to witness a very good beautiful panoramic view of the Baku city After this we'll left for a last spot the Nizami street at Nizami street and it's a very very pretty street there are so many restaurants around and we're just we're just thinking kaha ja ke turkish coffee pee sakte yaar life goes up and it goes down i know my mom taught me that i figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time being so serious idiots thinking it will matter keep me company downtown before the clock runs out sun is shining but the rain is welcome to friends are nearby don't need another view time is not on my mind but then it's here oh i love it when the love comes around and then i remember all things must pass but i'm not gonna wake up So on a last day, on a day three of Baku, we went to Mud Volcanoes. Same thing. Here, Adu is trying to say, but the camera mic was not captured correctly because the ride was a very bumpy ride. Basically, you have to take a private taxi to reach to the Mud Volcano spot, and there are some seven to eight cabs, and in their midst, there is an internal fun race. And the cab driver was speeding towards the location, and the ride was very bumpy, but a lot of fun. These mud volcanoes are amazing. If you see, these are live mud volcanoes. The bubbles are popping out. The bubbles basically is the methane gas that is coming from the ground and popping out. If you put a spark on it, this can catch fire because the methane is coming from the ground. And this is the mud. This you can use for your uh, face, like Multani mud. It is supposed to be good for your skin. Of course, we got some back in India. Looking at the tracker, how it is. Hopefully, it is good. 
the last place we went to is the fire mountains here the fire keeps on burning be it snow be it rain this fire will keep on burning from the methane that is coming from the ground we chilled a little over there before heading back to our hotel So this is our last day in Baku today and we're leaving for home like always for every trip that we have the feeling is the same that ghar nahi jana yeah we are like kya yahan pe chai pad mil jaye mast aaram ko there are lots of things to explore which nahi mila time hame and uh, we were running really short on time for a few things yeah but it's okay there's always next time there is always a next time and there's always an opportunity cost like we did certain things that we wouldn't have been able to experience otherwise so yeah overall it was a great trip what i wanted to tell you guys is that we are uh, here today and it's the 26th of june uh, and we complete 6 months of marriage today and the best part over here is that i don't know how coincidental this is but today is valentine's day in azerbaijan yes today and is valentine's day in azerbaijan and today is the day we complete 6 months of marriage how cool is that how cool is that i think it's a very very great thing i just wanted to come and share this with you because it's so nice that we're here it's our 6 month 6 month anniversary and it's valentine's day over here so yeah that's what it is that's a wrap for baku we are heading to the airport now and it was an awesome trip was it not how did you have fun i had so much fun there was so much there are so many things that we did which were new and nice yeah bye guys